I want to do a quick review of 13 Fishing's The Jerk. It's basically their version of a jerk bait, but it's much more than that. I've been experimenting with it for the lat, well, for this whole summer and into the fall. And it's very versatile in the fact that it's my new favorite chatterbait trailer. This thing has so much movement. These things flutter and they go back and forth and it's an incredible chatterbait trailer. Love that. I got, uh, this is magic sauce color on a green pumpkin. A couple different colors that I use with my chatterbaits. I don't get very crazy in my colors. I usually throw a green pumpkin, black, blue like this, or a white. And I'll throw in a couple random ones that I custom make throughout the season. But I have a core three color is just white, green pumpkin, and black and blue. But this is just a black and blue with a little bit of purple on it. This is the blackberry cobbler like this. Right, this one's blackberry. So on the black blue, I throw different two different colors, the blackberry cobbler and just all black. Just pe depends on the light conditions and the water clarity. Um, if it's really, really dark and dirty, I'll go with the solid black, which is the new moon color. And any other time it's stained or anything, I'll just go with the blackberry cobbler on my chatterbait. Another thing, it's their version of a jerkbait and it works really well. This is just weightless, just a white, just rig weightless, phenomenal little jerk bait. Those things walks the dog underneath the water. Another good thing is on a Carolina rig, throw that in like a, like a collard greens, like here, a magic sauce color. This is just your basic magic sauce color. Throw that on a Carolina rig. Even the black works really good. It, maybe it looks like a leech or something, but caught a bunch of fish on doing, using that on the Carolina rig. Also, I've been, just been doing this fall, I've been throwing it on a swim jig. And I've been catching, I've been catching a lot of fish on it. So, and I just recently started throwing it. I didn't think it was, would have enough, enough uh, motion in it, but these things, when I, pump the rod these things just go up and down it's really a good good little bait and it allows it with because of the surface there it allows it to skip really easy so that's my take on on the 13 fish and jerk it's very versatile it's pretty i mean it, it lasts a while I've, I've caught a ton of fish on this and it's still still going so it's pretty durable too so it's a great little bait give it a try check them out at 13fishing.com